after um, the song we haven't posted last week, um, I was in Cape Town. Um, for Lucky, for Lucky for some. Lucky for some. Indeed. You can tell she's slightly browner than me, but uh, slightly, slightly, slightly browner. Um, so today, what we're going to be talking about is our hair. Um, we've had quite a lot of you guys asking, um, is it real? Where did you get your colour done? How do you achieve those sort of beachy waves that we have sometimes? Um, so is it long? Is it short? Um, loads of different <laughs> questions. So, we're so gonna, we thought we'd uh, clear yeah. that up for you guys today. Cool. So naturally, I would say both our hair, I'd describe both our hair as quite, quite fine. Mm -hmm. It breaks quite easily. Um, it basically doesn't look like this. Um, so kind of for the past kind of six years, on and off, we've always had extensions. Yeah. Um, but these, without a doubt, have definitely been our favourite ones, haven't they? Hundred sure. percent. So we've got them done about a month and a half ago now um, at an incredible salon called Port Edmonds um, in Knightsbridge, um, done by uh, an incredible hairstylist called Polina. Now these extensions are called Beauty Works, um, really and good. they're really supposed good. to be yeah some of the best extensions out there. Um, loads of celebrities wear them, like Victoria's Secret models. Yeah. Um, and definitely feels like the best sort of um, extensions I've ever had. We have had yeah. we've had about four or five different hair extensions. We've definitely we had our fair share of really, really bad hair extensions. Yeah. Um, when I say bad, uh, I mean like Jordan was sitting in a salon and literally took about seven hours to cut oh, un don't un unknock God, all her hair. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, even the hairdressers were trying to give, yeah. it to give the job to somebody else to do because they were like, this is near impossible. Honestly, when you have extensions, you need to make sure that you brush them and you look after them yeah. because I've, you know, not always done that. I've not always been that great no, with sort of mentally. Neither of us have. Um, so I think. Also, the, the best thing about these extensions, for me anyway, is the colour. Um, and yeah. it's a guy called Jack Howard who does the colour, who actually works at Port Edmonds. Yeah, he um, does the colour. He colours the extensions, uh, he pre-colours them. Um, he's like an expert colourist, he's amazing. Yeah. Um, which, which which is how we've achieved this like balayage look. Mm -hmm. Whereas before, when, when we've had extensions, they've just been that kind of one block colour, which obviously I don't think looks, looks yeah. as good. Indeed. And I think most of our compliments have actually come from the colour. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, the colour's so nice. Yeah. How did you achieve it? Just well, like that sun kiss it's look. Um, a guy called Jack Howard, so um, he's really, yeah. he's really good. He's super super um, great. But in general, Paul Edmonds and Salon's amazing. Um, it's literally five stars. We walk in, Incredible. literally get the best service. They, how long did the extensions take? It, was it took quite a few hours. hours. It took about three and a half, four. I know about four, four hours. To, but it wasn't. It, it, was, it wasn't bad at all. We literally we were served really nice juices. I could, foods. Yeah, I could spend all day in there. Yeah. I mean, if ever if any of you guys are looking to get extensions done, even to get a blow dry, just a cut. Um, and you're in West London, 100% go to Port Edmunds. It's, I, I reckon it's one we'll always go to Definitely, now, isn't it, for definitely. sure. Um, Amazing. So, so yeah, that's that. Um, now in terms of actual products that we use on our hair, um, quite a few really, don't we? Mm, I don't, to be no. fair, I don't really use that many products. I think we're quite prone to getting greasy hair, so I mean we've dark, always got to use the obligatory uh, dry shampoo. Um, and uh, this is the one we use actually at the moment, is the um, Aveda dry shampoo, which is really great. All you do is you turn the little nozzle here, and um, you literally just, I don't want to get all dry shampoo in my hair, but just Basically, you spray literally like that. And you can um, yeah, Vida's yeah. really, really good for the dry shampoos. Mm -hmm. They're amazing. Um, just if you've got a bit of oily hair, just putting a bit on the front um, really, really helps. Um, in terms of how I normally wear my hair, I'll just normally use um, curling tongs that I got from GHG. Mm -hmm. um, they've actually just recently sent us uh, these new um, curling tongs, which were absolutely amazing. Um, I use them every day, to be fair, uh, just to give it that kind of loose wave look. Um, and along with it, they also sent us a really, really nice uh, brush, which is amazing because with these extensions, you do need quite a good brush. You need to make um, sure you're brushing your hair twice a day as well. Yeah, just to keep all those all those knots out. Um, so yeah, this GHD brush and, and curling tongs are what I use. And as well, um, a bit of hairspray. Um, this is Revlon Professional. I've always used this. It's absolutely massive. So it, I've literally had it for like five months. Um, and I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get through it anytime soon. But if it's really good, it really makes your hair stay in place. And um, yeah, I think that's, that's that. That's it with the hair extension. So we have, can keep these in for three months. Um, we advise to take them out after three months. I stupidly, last time I had my extensions in, left them in for a good six to seven months. And um, when Polina at Paul Edmonds removed my hair extensions, um, unfortunately, most of her hair fell out with it. Most of her hair fell out. Yeah, I've got 
such thin hair. So, um, yeah, you do need to make sure that after, yeah, after that three month mark, either go and get them redone or taken out, yeah. just to give your hair, you know, that that bit of breather again. Yeah. Um, sure. But I definitely think I'm going to go another few months with these. Um, and, and then I'll probably reapply them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> get, get them redone. Really get them redone. Really um, so yeah, I hope you guys um, are now, you know, clued up about um, our hair. If you like it, if you mm -hmm. don't. Um, leave your comments below whether you like them. If there's any uh, hairstyles you'd like to see us wear, please do let us know as well. Feel free to, um, yeah, give us some advice and tips. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, until next week, guys. See you later.